And there we go. We have connection. Hallelujah. Well, my friend, look at you. Look at me. Here we are. Still alive. Are you on the island or the mainland these days? I'm in Vancouver. How about you? Oh, I'm in Victoria. Okay. But were you going back and forth or you're not anymore? Or Yeah, I was for about six months or at least six months. Uh, now I'm still stuck here but i'm enjoying it but yeah i'm still basically sitting here in victoria uh, and um what happened with the vancouver thing uh, covid just slowed it down you could say <laughs> kind of eliminated it eh? <laughs> have you been doing a lot of online stuff yeah i think so i hope so <laughs> i see you you're making your videos do you know each time I see your video, I want you to get an editing program and put a front, put a back, and add stuff in the middle and have some fun with it. And I just, I wonder if you would ever do that. Deal. Do you want me to give you the name of the program I use? Yes, that'd be great. Okay, let me just... Um... So tell me, what, what have you been up to on your own? Hmm. Um, okay. Uh, well, I'm not on my own. I have my girlfriend, Amanda. Right. We, we live together, and uh, I manage a house here. So we have one roommate with us in the upstairs, and then three that live in the suite in the basement. So that's been part of my duties. My role is like house manager, and it's going really well. Um, and I'm a good house person. Like, I'm a very outgoing, extroverted, socialite, human, business, whatever. But I actually thrive in my own, on my own property, like many people or men, especially. I really like, I got poodles now and I'm building shit. And I built garden for vegetables. And um, we we're, here's one thing you'll really enjoy, I think, is... We had a spare bedroom pop up in our house and instead of filling it immediately, we decided to um, see if we could get it sponsored and, and uh, buy the bedroom on a monthly lease by this, through the sponsor so that we could build a studio, an online studio, uh, or like a digital studio. Yeah, so that's what, we're, that's what I'm sitting in. And this is just the uh, you know, it's a nice carpet now and there's my computer and Amanda's desk. It's pretty basic because we just started, but we're getting it all together here. Oh, it's nice. I mean, I, I just put this green screen up today. And, um, you know, in Zoom, you can put a background. I don't know, nighttime doesn't work that well. I was trying it out, but uh, during the day it works well. So you can pretty much have a, a, a background for whatever you want in Zoom without doing any editing. So mm -hmm. I don't know if you, you want to put a green screen in, but we have one. You have one. Okay. okay. Because I think like these types of conversations, we all we do is put a different backdrop and I mean, that's it. You know, you don't need more than that. Mm -hmm. What's that program called? The editing one. Right. Um, so what I've been doing is I'm starting to get media teams of four people, planetary guardians of four people. And I'm sharing, mass sharing the work with people and charging $25 each for an hour. So $100. So I'm making $100 an hour. The people are paying $25 an hour. And then I'm teaching them to use my stuff to do the same thing. So any map, I do one map per session. And then once you've got it, then you can do the same thing. So I'm teaching people to make $100 an hour online by teaching the work I have. But in fact, you could teach anything really. But my stuff I, I like because it's it's mine. So I, I have a great deal of value in, in passing it on. But I just think that formula is pretty easy. A lot of people can afford $25 a week, $100 a month. And I do one session once a week with them in four week modules. And then I'm looking at at the end of the nine months, people can go off on their own. And basically if, if I can teach people to make $100 an hour 
in nine months, or I mean, it could be earlier as soon as somebody feels confident enough to do it. I think you could take what I have and do exactly what I do easily. I mean, it's, it's not like I'm doing anything difficult. Um, it's just taking people through a process. Yeah. Um, do you, do you, uh, what does it look like? Do you involve the, the cards and the, and the circles and the boards? Well, at some point right now, it's just basically getting them to draw a map. Like I'm just getting them to do the basic maps, which I've come up with and don't even need cards. You don't need anything. You just need a piece of paper and a pen and, um, and that's it. And so I've got two teams. I'm looking at creating five teams. So I'm going to be working, have one meeting a day. And that makes a basic uh, income of 2000 a month. And that's only with 20 people. And then if you want to do one-on-ones, if you want to do, you know, anything else, you can just add on to that. So uh, I think that's how I'm proceeding. And then you get the five teams and then you make a superhero team of 20 people. And I'm currently working on a software program of multiple chat rooms where you can program the chat room with the conversation type. So as a set a goal, have a conversation type, have a timer and have a point score. And so it's the beginning of the Planetary Guardians game where then the media teams, you know, have missions where, you know, if you want to have fun, have a timer, have something to do. And using Zoom and using all the other tools, you use the... You, you solve the mission, whatever it is. And then the missions all build the larger sort of shared knowledge community. And that's how we change the economic system by creating a new cell for the economic system. Rather than a corporation, we create a shared knowledge community. Okay, it's called video slideshow. If you, if you look at the... Um, can you see that little icon? Yes. That's what you want to look, because I think there's a bunch of video slideshow things, but that's the icon. And it's, I find it very simple to, to use. Um, and then, you know, you just put frames on top of what you're doing. Give it a front, give it a back. Uh, and, and then there's so many little creative things that you can add into what you're doing. I think you've got, you know, a great show. I mean, I was thinking, you know, a motivational sort of thing of the week. Or uh, what, what did I say? A challenge of the week where you were giving, because you seem to do that with people, right? You're giving them something to do. That one that I took with it when you're standing on the chair at the desk. You're, you're cut, you come up with, come up like with a, a magnificent challenge of the week and then just spend some time on the video. Like so many people are doing videos these days, right? And uh, it's fine. You, you do a Facebook Live. You're very good at, uh, at, at what you're expressing. But I just think with edit editing, you could take it to a new level. So what do you think? Do you want to be one of the media teams? Do you want to get like four people together? Or uh, I'm currently got a few that I'm putting together on a team. Um, so if you can't find anyone, I, I, I'm going to be making three more teams of four people. And these are... I could bring in people I know because then the advantage is people that I know as associates in my life get the same training. Yes. And we all pay 25 a month, maximum four per group. 25 a session. So it's uh, uh, yeah. one yes. session a week. And yeah. so it's a hundred a month. And what yeah. I'm doing is I'm looking at helping people to, to create a kind of school system where you get a hundred students at a hundred a month. So teaching people to make 10 grand a month. By getting by utilizing this, you, the, the, one of the end goals is like ten thousand a month, where you have a hundred students, and then you can al always have more than that. But I think most people would be pretty happy with ten grand a month working online. Yeah. Hey, uh, Elijah, I was just taking notes. What were what were you saying about the video? You know, making one challenge of the week video. I got that the whole gist there. Okay slideshow software and playing with that there was one other thing you really had a point about something um i'm not sure about teams of four and then five teams of four because i just think that you know with what you're doing in univera that a big missing piece is sort of like a different type of teamwork a different type of, like if you could put teams together of four which would be the goal you do exactly what i do and then you 
you start with your four and then each of your four then creates a team of four and then you have a super team of 20. Okay. And, and I tell you for your downline or for if you could get those 20 together and have each of them in a weekly team meeting that starts off with what I have that gives a new type of communication system to them and then you can format it to what you want to take them on afterwards. Yes, I have an idea. See if you're into this. I'll pay for the for the, the first month for May. I'll go on my own journey and uh, do a month with one of your already pre -cert I want to call it prefabricated. I don't mean like that, but you're you know a group that comes naturally to you. I'll be one of four and just put me into a group. I'll go through the system once. I'm sure I'll love it. I'm sure I'll bring value to the whole group. That's what I love to do. And then we'll have fun. And then in month two, which is June, presuming all goes well, which all does go well. That's how I choose to live. Um, getting in group of four makes sense. And I would love to sort of like, I would love for it to work. There's no part of me that doesn't want it to. So, and if I could get four and make it 20 and we all win and Univera wins and we have fun with, with what you've been working on for fucking years, that'd be just great. So I'm in for May. I'll do a month and play okay sounds good sounds good so that was the main reason i wanted to chat with you i am just at that point where now i'm starting i know exactly what to do and before i was just formulating inventing and you know being a sort of a crazy inventor and now i can sort of be a crazy entrepreneur and it's amazing the contacts that are coming in right now and the software system is just wild like the little we've done with just a little bit I, it's, it's we're going to transform the whole nature of chat rooms and that's the basis for you know people coming together online and and and, and communicating so mm. i i think and then for you to bring it if you want into univera we could custom design the whole thing for univera oh man i mean mm -hmm. I, I i just they're missing so many pieces and if they had them that company would just rock i'm sure you're rocking already but um that uh anyway So is there a night, a time, a day, a time during the day that is good for you? Yes, that's a very true, yes, it's very important. Um, I got flexibility in my schedule. Um, yeah. Is there anything to work with? Is there, is there other times that seem to be? Well, three o'clock is not like three o'clock Wednesday and Thursday is gone. Um, I think. It was more, I mean, I'm starting to fill up, but I still got a lot of empty space, so. Okay, I'll, I'll take a moment here and look at my Google Calendar. I swear if I ever win a Grammy or an Oscar or something, one of the people in my speech that I'm gonna thank is Google Calendar. <laughs> uh, very grateful for their system. Okay, my friend. So this is like an hour a week. Yeah. Okay. So what uh, I mean, we gotta we gotta sort it out with other people too. So that's what um, I figured. See, I I, I kind of feel like going with the flow on that. See what the other people need, and, and I bet I can make it make it work. Okay. Okay. Is there anything else you need? Because I I I've had a long day, and I I think this is all I wanted to to do with you is take you to the next step on this one. Yes. Um. Keep me in the loop. Yeah, keep me in the loop and let me throw it out there that Mondays work good. Uh, both the day or night? So what I've, it's pretty flexible actually, to be honest with you. Um, let's just say Monday, I'm, I'm very free on Mondays and- um, Okay. Yeah, okay, let's, Monday's, Monday's good. Yeah, let's aim for Monday. I'll just be honest, the only time I can't guaranteed is between like, five and six thirty p.m okay okay i'm gonna to aim towards monday okay great and the people that i know that i'm thinking of they're uh it's a great group you're going to be a pretty strong team and uh i really look forward to uh to doing this with you good all right great to see matthew and uh, we'll be in touch soon awesome take care good night